Greetings and salutations, I am Keb. Welcome back to this let's play of Sid Meier's Civilization 3 as the Maya. Uh, been a week since I touched the game, so <laughs> it'll take a few moments for me to remember what I was up to. We we're building the Forbidden Palace there to try to improve our corruption issues. We're building some wonders, hopefully we'll be able to beat the Byzantines, who are, I think, quite a potent save. They've built quite a few wonders. And they even tried to land a city down here. And as I loaded the save, I noticed, hey, they've landed up here as well. So, yeah, they've been... They're pretty aggressive about city settling. I think it's okay then to leave this part of the world to to the Vikings. Rather than see the Byzantines join and get that as well. Oh, well. Uh, we'll just jump right, jump right in. We are researching music theory. We're trying to get the... Um, oh, what's it called? Uh, the uh, Box Cathedral. Oh, uh, yeah, right. They were, uh, they were sending naval units over here, so I'm starting to think there's something out there. Uh, wait, what? Oh, city started to unrest. You went into unrest. How dare you? There we go. Oh, right. Uh, and we also kind of fudged up this town with unrest. 22 turns, I have no idea if we'll be able to do that. Uh, can we get any more hammers out of this? Well, we could steal the mine over there. Though I'm not sure we could actually move a non-growth square there. No, we have zero growth, so this is the best we can get. Oh, well. Building Colosseums, libraries, and I'm itching to start a war with Sumeria and get their wonders and especially get their gems, but uh, just not sure if we have enough troops for that. I probably do. We have uh, the mountains here defended. I don't know. It's worth thinking about, if nothing else. Um... Right, uh, I think you are going to go and build a mine up here. Ooh, another crusader. You join the ground group. And a double barbarian. I think we've improved everything down here. And Chichen it says isn't gonna grow for a while, but uh, given that a size 12 is where everything is just locked off for a good while, a good while more, because we are not gonna get hospitals that quickly. Mm. Still, uh, that square is beyond us. Right, I had you guys out here as well. Yeah, you're kind of vulnerable if a war starts. Not just kind of either. Uh, Palenque, what are you? What uh, is your situation? You probably need more hammers. Well, you're size nine. You're still growing. So yeah, I'm thinking of mine. Right, I had a galley there, and I wanted to explore what the heck these, what the heck they were going for. I suspect there's something out here. Somewhere, let's see, we can't cross here, but... Uh, can we? Wait a second, look. Is there something here? Um... What do I even see? Let's go there first. All right. Oh, this was also the last settler. I'm gonna go and just plop down a fishing village way up and way south, actually, way way down. There we go. Kaba. And we have a spearman. Yeah, just gonna wait one turn and rush the spearman and free up these infantrymen. I think I still want him guarding. 
still, I think I still want to guard those spots just in case the AI sends over. Uh, some people they shouldn't send over some settlers or something. We don't want them suddenly uh, taking our territory. Yeah, let's irrigate that way. Yeah, all right, we were sending all our athlete lists. Or all our javelin throwers. Oh, mixing up my saves now. Uh, yeah, javelin throwers, bringing them home. It's gonna be good. Yay, music theory. What's the big picture? Let's see. Right, we were considering pushing into astronomy just so we could get that wonder. And of course, there's also democracy and... Uh, yeah, two wonders up there. I really don't want to lose uh, the tower. Right, because... Right click, no. Right click on the picture, no. There we go. Click enough times and something happens. <laughs> um, yeah, Copernicus Observatory. Double scientific research. We have really kind of want that. Yeah, fine. Well, let's go scientific. Or restored. What was it that happened down there? Missed the message. I missed the message. How much food do you have? Three turns of growth. You know what? Uh, cut that food, just do that. Just. Yeah, do just stay at, stay at this size. Just finish the Forbidden Palace in 16 turns. Just get that done, please. And of course we still have so much jungle. Ugh. And that's pure desert. Tikal, what are you actually producing? You're producing on these squares. On the food there. You don't really care about... Uh, the flatlands here. Probably won't care either, actually. Uh, let's go and build some mines instead. Uh, actually, just fortify up. You're gonna stay there for a long time. And I believe we already finished both the road and the mine here. Yep. Um, I want the square sense as soon as as soon as we have uh, ugh, words they escape me. Do I have a road up here? No. Yeah, as soon as the border pops, we want access to that sugar, so might as well build the road. And just how many workers are here? So two of you there. Two of the Oh right! These are all the ones that were captured. Because we were kind of killing barbarians. Completely forgot we were doing that. Whoops. You're there, and since you're, since we don't have the goody wonders, we can't get further out. Oh well. Right, so we need to switch production. Hello, Copan. You're not going to build a palace after all. You are going to build John Sebastian Box Cathedral, and we need to find another town that can start producing uh, the Leonardo's workshop. No, the um, tower, uh, or. Do we? Let's see now. Advisors, let's just check. 
foreign advisor, Miss Theodora. Like to propose a deal. Let's see, Artex. You don't have literature, you don't have theology. Wait, what? Okay. They don't have literature, they don't have theology. Let's just go back to the tree. With that knowledge. They don't have theology. Okay, so they can't build the 16 chapel. At least not right now. I know that they're building... Um, uh, yeah, the workshop. But they haven't researched gunpowder yet. They don't have theology, so they can't have education, so they can't have astronomy or music theory. That's fine. And chivalry is already done. They don't also don't have literacy. I've never understood the tech tree here, so... Given these uh, gaps. <laughs> so what does literature... Uh, yeah, we know these secrets. I know, but... Uh, do we actually need... Requires, allows... Doesn't It doesn't even say. What gives you access to the next age? Ah, Civilopedia, help me out here. Ah, and you want to give me the tech Civilopedia? I want the actual Civilopedia, there we go. Uh, I just don't know what to look for. Ages, Eris. Maybe just scientific research. There we go. Da -da -da, scientists, civilization advance. Oh yeah, it's been so long since I played this, so yeah, trying to recall the <laughs> finer points is gonna take ages. You guys probably know, remember this game better than I do. Um, I got the impression you had to research all the text in order to start researching on the next age, but uh, if that's the case... Uh, if that's the case, the Byzantines shouldn't be able to not have literature. So... That's why I'm trying to figure out what is the actual limit here. And I don't see... Anything in concepts on that? Ah, boo. An index is where we already are, I suppose. Or you just get everything. Which is kind of worthless. Ah, never mind then. Okay, so how I assume it works then. If the tech has a dead end symbol, it is a dead end. But the other checks. Like map making, horseback riding, polytheism. These texts you need, but you don't need the end texts. So you don't need to research Republic, Monarchy, or Literature in order to advance. But you do need the others. I think. I could be very, very wrong. If that's the case, we should be able to advance as soon as we get these two texts. I might have to experiment on that. Yeah. Then again, why would then this have a crossover symbol since it's not an end tech here? Ah, yeah, I don't know. Never mind. Uh, what the other sieves? I assume that you're so far behind, you don't really matter at all. Yeah, you lack so much. Goodbye. Sumeria, of course, is techish. And they do have education. They lack engineering, though. That's a good guy. Well, that was rather nasty. So they have education. So they could potentially get astronomy rather quickly. But they don't have engineering, so they can't build this. But that's fine. Uh, and let's see, wonder key, wonder key. There was a, which key was that again? Let's see if we can find it. There we go. Wonders of the world. Of course, it's not organized anywhere. Uh, in any way. 
is it? Being constructed. Yeah, they're built. They are building the Sixteen Chapel, as are we. I don't know if we can get it first. I have no idea. And of course, that means they have production to switch over to something else. Uh, the Byzantines are building Leonardo's workshop. We will be able to build that first. So yeah, these are. Of course, there are still other civs out there. I believe one civ has been eliminated, but there are still at least. Yeah, how many more are? did we play with? Another two? I forget. I forget. Let's see here. There's room for one, two, three, four more. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? We'll find them when they find them, and that should be soon. We're getting astronomy. That should give us some ships, maybe. Uh, you finished that. Yeah, you're, of course you want a pikeman. You want defense. I can see that. Given that you only have a warrior. That is a bit weak, I agree. Uh, but you don't have a barracks, and we need barracks. To do something about that. You also have a lot of unhappy workers, but that is okay. Overall, you're balanced. So fine, you do that and then build a pikeman. And then we'll see. Colosseum and a courthouse. Uh, you're pretty darn close to the capital. Lots of unhappy people, but this should bring you into balance without needing entertainers, which is very good. Let's see, harbors, that gives food, food yields, yes, yes. But, yeah, not really a priority. Universities would be awfully nice. Courthouses would only... Yeah, corruption, corruption. I'd like to get rid of corruption by going into democracy. I forget if democracies kill corruption or not. No, it, I think it does. I'll, I'll have to go check that again. Oh, you finished the marketplace and going for library. Yeah, that's okay. Actually. Da, 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 civilopedia. Government. Democracy. Let's see. You're awarded with increased commercial production. Yep. Uh, corruption is minimal. So it doesn't go away completely. So it's still... Somewhat okay to build uh, courthouses. And of course, I went to the uh, volcano. Yeah, I can't improve the volcano. Step off the volcano. Step off the volcano, and no one gets hurt. Um, yeah, I cut the, down the forest there. Uh, but I can't farm that tile. Wait a second, it's a mine there, isn't there? You yeah, built a mine on that one. Ah, never mind then. Cut more jungles. Get rid of them. I think I'm going to send you to the jungle area as well. Getting rid of that is probably the best thing we can do. Make the towns more healthy. Uh, I'll grab a food square. We need some food. Same thing here, really. Some food, some production. We'll mix and match a bit. I believe we built a mine on that one. Yep, we did. And you might as well farm this one. Um... I want mines. Production. Wants. Let's see, you did finish a road here. Yes, you did. But not there. Right, okay, so connect that. Keep moving along here. We need to 
see if there's something out along the coast. I really wonder. Oh, and um, let's rush the spearmen. Get it done. Just get the spearmen out so we can get the Atlas list to move away. Well, I keep saying that. Javelin thrower, there we go. Oh, it was moving through. I'm fine then. And at some point we'll have a culture pop here and then hopefully uh, we can deter any chance of anyone landing a town there. I suppose as long as the tile exists they will potentially land there. Which could be bad. The chicken sack cannot grow because it's size 12. Uh, you could grow potentially. Oh, you have zero growth now. Good. That means you're not going to suddenly go into unrest on me. Tlacopan. You have one entertainer and you're also at zero growth. Uh, and I want to check on industrial production. These are my three most productive cities, yes. And next after that is Palenque. Which is this one. And you'll start producing even more hammers. I think I want to switch you over to the palace. Yes, do that. Don't do anything else. Yeah, par palace for you. Just start saving up hammers. Or shields, rather. And just get a head start on a wonder. I think that's gonna be fine. If we lose the 16 chapel, then we really have to go and say hi to the Sumerians. I mean, we do have quite a large free army at the moment. In uh, with the uh, oh, what they're called that one, those ones, obviously, those ones. Yeah, the Crusaders. There we go. I remember it just takes a while. I have no idea if sitting parked on a volcano is a good idea, but uh, yeah, if I <laughs> if I suddenly lose the entire entire army due to an eruption, that's yeah. You never know. Strange things like that happen. And we probably want to make food. So let's see here now. I just want to see this. Terrain activity without... Food 5. Did I do that right? That flood floodplain has three food. This yields five without an irrigation? Wait, what? Oh, of course, there's wheat. Of course. Dough. Okay, so five wheat if I improve that. What do I get? And is that a single Viking? Hmm. Poor guy, he's working all alone. Doesn't have a teammate. And we have to wake up the other javelin thrower. There we go, I could say it. Just have them run down and join the main army. It'll take them a long time, but they'll get there. And they'll be out of breath by the time they get there, I think. Now you're still gonna go there, even if it's gonna take quite a few turns. If we go to war with him, we really have to secure Agalev quickly so he doesn't have iron. And after that, we just have to secure this so he doesn't have the gems. And then it's a matter of just pushing him, pushing him out completely. We know he has one city somewhere out here. Lagash. Which also has several wonders. Is that his board? Yes, it is. My goodness. Germany declares war on... Okay. Germany. Well, that explains one civ. And I suppose they've been aggressive. And killed off someone, maybe. Thought it was the Byzantines that they did that, but you never know. Uh, we're still gonna stay in our original style. Uh, yeah, let's top the whole thing off. There we go. Looks like a Chechen is just on the very top of the whole thing. 
Uh. Let's see, you're here, you finished a mine, right? Yes. Come on, little towns, I need you to spread. And just uh, gain more room. Let's see, these are floodplains, I don't really need. Actually, this town needs the food, so fine. So let's see, floodplain gives three. And if I irrigate floodplain, just how much does they get? Okay, so it's only plus one there. Uh, okay. So they don't get the agriculture bonus. Boo. I'm allowed to cross here, since I can end up on the coast. Please don't tell me I told the spearmen to move. Did I? And... No. For a second there we got a crash message. Yeah, I did tell the spearmen to move. Whoops. We'll have to fix that. I'm kind of worried now. So we got a non-responsive message from the game. I'm thinking we're gonna do a quick save here. Just in case something terrible happens. like it when the game gives me that kind of warning. Uh, oh right, now it's the Crusader. Uh, yeah, the Crusader can't swim. So it's kind of dumb to try to move him into the water. It's gonna take a long time before these squares are useful. But I can't have everyone uh, cutting down jungles either. Need to distribute the labor somewhat. Yeah, the spearmen go back there. You kind of need to stay there and fortify. Oh, I already had a road there. Ugh. Fine then. Um, not much I can do out here. We're not gonna get fresh water. One food, two gold, and no shields. Do we want to plant a forest here? Forest should yield what? Two shields, same as a mine. But it's on tundra terrain, so let's see up here. Two shields versus nothing at all. So a forest and a mine are essentially the same thing on a Tantra Square. But why does this have two? Oh, of course, the road. That's why they have two gold. You don't get more food from a forest, so why... Yeah, so why does it cost more to plant a forest when it has less use? Oh, it's because you can chop down the forest and get production out of it, maybe? I don't know, but we're definitely gonna build a mine then. You finished that. Um, you don't have... you don't have... Uh, no irrigation yet, so... Just make a short road there. Four turns. I keep getting I just so paranoid. Let's see. Come on, Theodora. Talk to me. Still oh you reset gunpowder, you bastard. Okay. I suppose you'll need it. Engineering and music theory hasn't changed X yet. 
Okay, so she went the other way. She should not be able to get uh, either wonder. So she won't be able to uh, utilize the hammers that she'll have one. Yeah, she won't suddenly be able to pop out another wonder. She'll have to abandon her uh, building project. So the question now becomes 16 chapel. If it can be done or not. A granary, and you want to build a pikeman? No, 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 no. You need to build. What do you need to build? A library and a marketplace. Get those up and running. Granary, and then into an aqueduct. Yeah, that's fine. Surprise me actually for there to be something out there just to annoy me. And that's the road finished. Good. take a short break here and we will resume this next episode hopefully we'll be able to build some wonders then thank you for watching